Yo, what's up guys, welcome back again to another Clash Royale video And for today, I do have another deck strategy slash guide to show you So, this is the deck we're gonna be using in today's video As you can see, I'm in Legendary Arena, I did make a video a few days ago I reached Legendary Arena using this exact deck As you can see, all the battles are with this deck so this is by far my best strategy I've ever made But enough rumbling, this is the deck I'm gonna be using in today's video And show you all the combos, the giant, the musketeer, the valkyrie, the minion horde The fireball, the arrows, the prince and the skeleton army I guarantee you do have all those cards If you do not have the skeleton army or the uh, prince These are the only two cards that you may not have You can use uh, the witch instead of the prince and instead of the skeleton army, use the skeletons, a uh, tombstone, or some fire spirits, alright? But if you do have all those cards, put them all together, it will work, I guarantee that to you. So, 4.3 average elixir cost, let's jump straight into some live battles and show you how this deck works. So, we go against this level 10, he's angry. Why are you angry? Um, so, good luck. Alright, and what you want to do with this deck is drop the giant here as far as possible and build up elixir to deploy even more cards behind that giant because you want the giant to tank for every other card you have. Take all the damage so that all the other cards are undamaged and can destroy the tower, the opponent's tower. So I'm gonna drop the Valkyrie in this case among with uh, the musketeer, let's see if he does any minions, I'm gonna drop that uh, those arrows, no he does not have any minions, but he deployed those barbarians, as you can see that Valkyrie did some work against them, He, she actually killed them, oh, uh, I even damaged his tower, got it down to 1600, that mini pack, I don't think it's gonna be enough to touch my tower, come on, ah, perfect, uh, killed it, uh, before she even touched my tower, perfect, and another combo you want to do with this deck is the Prince Minion Lord combo, it is deadly, if the opponent, like in this case, doesn't have a fireball, it's deadly, it cannot be stopped, he dropped those three musketeers, I actually managed to kill one of them, he's angry, um, I don't blame him, <laughs> I pretty much screwed him up with this, um, with that combo, cause he wasted 9 elixir, and he did not did anything, he could not defend his tower, so um, I would not recommend uh, trying to get the 3 run right away unless you do have a huge push building up but play it safe, go for the other crown instead of the um, 3 crown right of the start so I'm gonna fireball his minion horde and his valkyrie perfect got all of them as well, he hasn't even touched my towers yet, look at that at full health, not even once. So, over time, not over time, I keep confusing them. Double elixir time. Um, so, he did drop his barbarians, okay, and don't have my Valkyrie or the Fireball now. Uh, and you, you don't want to drop your minion horde, because that wizard is going to kill all of your minions, alright? So, I'm going to drop another skeleton army. Come on, perfect, alright. I just want to save my tower. I'm not going to do any uh, crazy push. I just wanna keep, play it safe, win 1-0, to zero, I'm fine with it. It's legendary arena up here, it's, <laughs> it's not fucking bone pit or anything like that. Um, so, uh, I'm gonna kill his uh, Valkyrie and his Prince with my minion horde, he's gonna get mad. Oh, he is gonna be mad after this. And almost his entire minion horde. Is he gonna rage quit? Let's see, come on, rage quit dude. I wanna see you rage quit. No, he didn't rage quit. Okay, let's laugh at him though. <laughs> that was nice. Alright, so he's angry. There you go. Uh, he's spamming and a giant chest. Holy shit, that is nice. So, let's go do another live battle. Okay, here we go against Evolution. A level 10 again. Okay, so, I hope you guys understood how uh, this deck works. Um... Not many combos, the only combo that you can call it a combo is the Prince with the Minion Horde. Apart from that, you won't have the Giant with any other card behind him. Um, so, he's not deploying anything. Come on, dude, I wanna play this freaking game, don't do this to me. Oh, and a P.E.K.K.A, okay. A P.E.K.K.A just there alone, I don't know why, but... He's gonna fireball my shit, F crap, if those Minions... Uh, we're still alive, I could have destroyed his P.E.K.K.A and his tower. 
shit. Uh, but uh, I'm doing some serious damage to his pack over there. I'm gonna drop this skeleton army over there. Okay, take out that P.E.K.K.A. I'm so worried about that P.E.K.K.A. I don't know why, but I'm really scared of P.E.K.K.A.s. The normal P.E.K.K.A.s, not the mini P.E.K.K.A.s. So, um, it's going good so far. I have slightly damaged his towers. Those skeletons even uh, hit his tower, got it down to 2200. So I'm gonna deploy a giant over there. He is gonna drop a collector, okay. I expected that since he has such an expensive an elixir expensive uh, deck with his P.E.K.K.A. And so, he has way better cards than me, like his uh, Prince was level 5, mine is only th level 3. Uh, so, I'm gonna deploy, what should I do, my Musketeer? Yeah. So, he dropped a Dark Prince, he has a P.E.K.K.A. double Prince deck, my friend. Uh, you are gonna get your tower destroyed over there, as you can see. Um, there we go, tower down. Uh, should I push? Yeah, I'm gonna push for the three crown. Let's see, can I get it? No. He's gonna fireball my minion horde, I suppose. No, he's not, okay. So, I damaged his tower quite well. Okay, so he fireballed now. Um, got his king tower down to 3300, and he's pushing the other side, okay. Um, do whatever you want. He hasn't, uh, oh, he has touched uh, my left tower, okay. Uh, but I need to be really careful because uh, double P.E.K.K.A., double Prince and P.E.K.K.A. decks are quite annoying to deal with because if you ignore the Princes and the P.E.K.K.A., they can really, really uh, destroy you. So, uh, alright, I need to stop rambling. That P.E.K.K.A., that Prince over there, sorry, is gonna get my tower. F shit. Uh, got it close to only 300 health, holy shit, no, I'm just gonna defend, not doing any push, there we go, I'm gonna win, perfect, I was kinda stupid in the end, he almost got my tower and he had a huge push on the left lane, but I actually managed to get the win, 1-0, to zero. it's still a win, if it's not uh, 3 crown, so that's gonna be for today's video guys, I hope this video doesn't go viral because then everybody's gonna start using this deck and it's gonna become trash. But no, okay, my videos don't go viral that often. So for those few people that are gonna actually watch this video so far, thank you very much. I hope this deck gets you to Legendary Arena or whatever you wanna do in Clash Royale, Ritz, I don't know, Frozen Pig, whatever. It is really good, do not underestimate it, try it out. So thank you very much for watching, for watching until this part of the video. If you're still watching, what should you comment today? Hashtag. Um, let me think. Hashtag Harry is a legend, alright? And if you comment that, you're a legend as well. So as always, make sure you leave a like down below and a comment telling me how you did with this deck. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you haven't subscribed already. And see ya in the next one. Played the game and I'm still the same and I never changed just to get a deal, but I'm ballin', ballin'. I came from nothing to something like it's nothing, yeah, you know I done it, that is no discussion, bitch, I'm ballin'. ballin'. I made a promise to my mama, I'ma turn these zeros into tens of commas, bitch, I'm ballin', ballin'. Closing million dollars.